Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video we are going to solve this interesting logical reasoning problem. So we have 6 equal to 31, 5 equal to 21, 4 equal to 13 and we need to find the 3. What will be equal to? What about these numbers? We have 7, 3, 5 and 9. So right, one, right now choose one option, choose one number and write your suggestion in the comment. And after 20 seconds we will check your knowledge, check your IQ, IQ skills. So choose one and write your suggestion about these 3. And right now we are going to find the pattern between all of these numbers. So take a look. We have right here even number odd, even odd, though it's not safe for me a lot. But let's try to find right right now the pattern between all of these numbers. So right here we have 31. How can we get this 30 or 31? I see right now on the left hand side that we have 6 and 5. So right here we have 6. I write these numbers right here. 6, 5, 4 and 3. Take a look. I, I see right now really interesting case because if we multiply these two numbers, so if you were talking about multiplication, we will have a really interesting case. We will have 6 times 5, so will be 30. And take a look right now on the next two numbers, two pairs of numbers. 5 times 4 will be, if you are talking about multiplication, will be 20. And the last one, 4 times 3, will be equal to we will have right now 4 times 3 will be equal to 12. But right here we have even numbers and right here we have odd numbers. And what the pattern between all of these numbers? We have right here 31, right here 30, on the right hand side, on the left hand side 21, on the right hand side 20, 13 and 12. Of course I hope you see right now that we need to add 1 to get these, to the, to get these numbers. So right here add 1, we will have 31, right here add 1 we will have 21 and right here add 1 we will have 13. So as you can see there is a pattern between all of these numbers. We multiply these pairs, these pairs and these pairs and we need to add add 1. 31, 21 and 13. What about these numbers? How can we find this one? Of course easily because under this 3 we will have of course 2. And let's use the same logic. We will have 3 times 2 if you are talking about multiplication. We will have 6. And we need to add 1 because there is a pattern between all of these numbers. So my option, my answer is 7. What about you? What, you ans what answer you wrote in the comment? So I choose option A. What the pattern you find between all of these numbers? It will be really interesting to read it. So write your suggestions in the comment. Put thumbs up. I really appreciate it. And I make logic videos every day. So if you like it, if you enjoy it, subscribe for more videos. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.